I have a few confessions to make to you. I pulled the trigger on an Instagram ad for a GQ subscription box last week. Now, I did this for two reasons. One, it was $29.99, and two, it came with a free Bluetooth speaker for starting your subscription that you can stop at any time. Now, I've needed a Bluetooth speaker, and so this right here was worth trying the box alone. I'll show you what I got, let you know what I think about it, let you know if I do it again, let you know if your guy's gonna like it. So, probably my second most favorite item out of this is this Rain's Weekend Bag. It's huge. Uh, the outside is a waterproof material, which is awesome. If you're traveling, happens to be raining, your stuff's not gonna get soaked. Love this. That bag is $95. Well worth, I've, I've already covered the cost of the box. So, those two items alone for me are worth this box. Uh, third item though that I really am excited about uh, are these no-show socks here. Uh, I love a good sports sock. I love a no-show sock. I always run out of socks. Perfect. Now, the next confession I have is um, I have to wear reading glasses. I can't see without them uh, to read things that are small. And so I'm going to go through real quick the rest of the stuff I got. Um, none of these are items that I would probably buy normally, but I'm going to try them out because they sent to me. So uh, first is this Oxford Mill uh, hair clay. Uh, it's rub it through your hair. It's supposed to keep everything uh, in place. I guess maybe like a gel. I'll let you know. <clears throat> Second is this uh, antioxidant treatment uh, for your skin. Uh, it's supposed to give you a natural glow and just be good for your skin. So, hey, we'll see. <clears throat> Uh, third is this bottle of hair and body wash. Uh, now, I'm a pretty simple guy. I pretty much just use whatever is purchased for me. Um, this is supposed to smell amazing, so hey, we'll see. <clears throat> Fourth is this uh, Avant uh, moisturizing cream. Now, it's for your face and supposed to keep your face not dry in the winter, but uh, I'm probably just going to use it for my hands. That, that's probably what your guy would use it for, too. <clears throat> The last two things I would probably never purchase, um, and I don't even know if I'm gonna use them, we'll see. Um, I'm intrigued, if nothing else, and one of them. Um, the one that I don't think I will use because this just isn't an issue for me is these Peace Out Acne Stickers. Um, now, I'm sure your guy uh, might have this problem. Maybe he doesn't, but there you go. Maybe if he does, this is a great product for you. And the last thing, uh, probably the weirdest thing in this box for me, is this sample of Trumi mushrooms. Um, these are gummies um, that, uh, this one is the Boost, there's another one that's Focus. I don't know, I'll try them. Uh, again, it's not something that I purchased, but there you go. So overall, uh, the GQ box, again, it cost me $29.99 because they were running a sale. Um, and so at that price, this box, I feel great about. Their normal quarterly price is $60. Um, now, I probably wouldn't spend that on myself, uh, $60 every quarter, uh, even though I think I got some really cool stuff and it was well worth the price. Uh, but if you're looking for um, a box for your guy and these are things that you think he might like as far as just general care stuff, uh, then hey, this might be a good thing. Each one of their boxes are gonna come with a big item, like the bag. Um, and then a bunch of just samples of different products that you get a discount on if you want to reorder. So overall, I think the GQ bag uh, box was a great uh, purchase because I got that Bluetooth speaker for free. And then I think this weekend bag is top notch.